Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video guys, I will show you some road sign or traffic sign in Australia. First road sign we have, here is Kiflev. So when you're turning, you always keep on the left side of the road. Like here, if they're turning, they always use the left side. Yeah, they always on the left side when they're turning. Three main types of road sign in Australia. The first one is regulatory. The second one is the warning. And the third one is day information. Warning signs, this alert you to possible danger ahead, usually yellow diamond shape with black symbols or words. Then the regulatory signs, this inform drivers of traffic laws and regulation. Road user must obey all instructions on regulatory signs. The road work signs, the next type is the road work sign. These are used at road works to create a safe environment for workers on and near the road. The example of regulatory sign includes stop, yell, do not enter, no turn on left, no turn on right, no parking, weight limit, speed limit, one way, and one lane ahead. Because they are used to regulate the flow of the traffic. That's why they called it regulatory sign and that's the most important also type of the traffic sign so we discuss first the no entry sign this sign means you are not allowed to enter the area ahead you must not drive past the sign if you see the sign you must not make a u-turn you can make a u-turn at any intersection without traffic lights or any break in the center island of the road un unless there is no u-turn sign. And this sign, like no entry sign, are required to indicate what person must not or should not do in particular area. This sign are designed to stop a particular behavior or an action. Giveaway sign are placed at intersection and other places where other vehicles have priority. Remember, there are lots of situations on the road where you must give way even if there is no sign like in the roundabout or when you're crossing a road. The next one is a stop sign. So in stop sign, you must come to complete stop and obey the give way rules. At the giveaway sign, you must slow down or stop if required and obey the giveaway rules. At the roundabout, if you see that, in the roundabout, there's a sign that you must slow down or stop if required and give way to all vehicles already on the roundabout. Speed signs reflect the maximum speed allowed, so you must travel at or below the speed shown. Some drivers may be subject to lower speed limits, including some heavy vehicles which are restricted to 100 km per hour. Runabouts manage the traffic flow at intersection. They move traffic in one direction around a central area, like a circle. A vehicle can turn left or right, go straight ahead, or make a full U-turn. When you approach a roundabout, you must slow down or stop to give it to the other vehicles that already in the roundabout. A no parking sign indicates to drivers that parking is not permitted in a particular area. These signs are recognized with a red text on a white rectangular background or the words no parking in white text on the red background in parking there's a lot of indication like this 2p 
For example, for this 2P, the 2P is a sign indicates that you can park for up to 2 hours between the hours indicated. Then the 1 half P sign indicates that you can park for a maximum, maximum of half an hour during the time specified. So parking sign let you know where you can park on the section of the road. This right turn only sign and the left turn only sign, it means that you just follow the arrow. If it's turning to right, just turn into right. If turning to left, just turn into left. Our animal road sign features like koala, kangaroo, wombat. These are the part of Australian road sign and animal road sign. The animals that are common, more common in Australian roads are kangaroo, echenna, and wallabies, koala, and other animals that might cro uh, come across like eagle, bird life, wandering cattle, and other animals. So that's why they have a road sign so that uh, to give you a warning. If you see this kind of sign, so you must uh, slow your uh, speed limit and we encourage driver to reduce speed and increase uh, vigilance. The narrow road sign is a warning sign indicates that the road ahead will not be as wide as the road you're currently on. This sign is a warning of upcoming potential hazard but no immediate action is required. In this sign, you need to reduce your speed limit. This is called a Chevron sign. A striking way to keep your driver safe, Chevron sign shows the edge of the road, dangerous curbs, or other hazard. Chevron sign are most often used in the outside of the curb or the narrowing of the road. Crossroad street sign are meant to alert you to an upcoming intersection or another road that is crossing your path. They're used to warm drivers to watch for incoming or turning traffic and be prepared to slow down or even stop if necessary. The divided highway sign means that the two lanes of opposing traffic on the highway ahead are divided by some type of physical barrier or a median such as quadril, concrete barrier, or a stripe of land. So what is the purpose of divided highway? When the roads are separated by barriers, the risk of accident is reduced substantially. Also, since all the vehicles are moving in the same direction, head-on and collisions cannot occur. This is the end of my vlog. In the next vlog, I will show you some traffic sign. And I hope you learned something from this uh, video. And thank you for watching. God bless. Bye-bye.